Walter Reed was born on Saturday, September 13, 1851. He went to the University of Virginia for a short time. Although already a legal doctor of medicine, he still went to Valuable Medical College once he finished his studies in the University of Virginia to gain more medical experience. Walter Reed was a bacteriologist and an army medical officer who helped find out how yellow fever was transmitted. Reed and his family moved to Charlottesville in 1866. After a period of time at the university, he transferred to the medical faculty, completed his medical course in nine months, and in the summer of 1869, at the age of 17, he became a legal doctor. Reed held several hospitals posts as an intern and was a district physician in New York. He decided against general practice, however, and for the security, chose a military career. In 1889, he was an appointed attending surgeon for an examined recruit of Baltimore. He also worked at John Hopkins Hospital. In 1893, he was assigned to the post of curator of the Army Medical Museum in Washington and a professor of bacteriology and clinical microscopy at the newly established Army Medical School. Reed's report wasn't published until 1904, when it revealed new facts regarding this yellow fever. At this time, many people believed in the yellow fever spread through objects touched by people with this disease. Even up to 1898, reports said it was spread this way. In 1898, Walter Reed went to Cuba to investigate typhoid fever, and then later, the yellow fever. Because of many Cuban soldiers being afflicted with the disease, also causing many deaths. Although some other theories for the yellow fever spread were presented during the time, Carlos Finlay, health scientist from Cuba and a specialist on medicine, presented the theory of insect transmission, but he was unable to prove it. In 1896, the Italian bacteriologist Giuseppe Sanadelli had claimed he had found an organism isolated in yellow fever patients, called Bacillus ectoroides. Later on, the U.S. Army assigned Walter Reed and James Carroll to investigate Guzzi Pest discoveries, as well as Artides Agramonte, an assistant surgeon for the U.S. Army. Agramonte was able to find Bacillus ectoroides not just from one-third of the yellow fever patients but from the people suffering other illnesses as well. Later in 1896, Reed was able to disprove soldiers being afflicted with the yellow fever through their drinking water, but at the moment he didn't know it was the mosquito who was causing it. Reed proved that an attack of yellow fever was caused by the bite of an infected mosquito. The symptoms of yellow fever are jaundice, the colors of your skin and eyes becoming yellow tint. Fever, headache, muscle pain, vomiting, nausea, and fatigue. The yellow fever originated in the southern portions of Africa, but to this day, the exact location is unknown. Reed was laid in Arlington National Cemetery. He died on November 22, 1902 due to his appendix rupturing and then later peritonitis.